and I would come down this hall, and they were just presents. If the trees where that chair is, presents would come out to here, man. And so that's the sense I'm making. The one thing is that I don't have autofocus, so I'll be constantly trying to <laughs> make the focus work. Um, <clears throat> Hello? Ha. Ah, top of the morning, friends and family. Once a week, we upload a beautifully edited cinematic masterpiece to this channel. This video is uncut. <laughs> And in today's Uncut video, we are at my grandma's house. I haven't done a video with my cousin in a while, so I thought, I was thinking about what are we gonna do? And we got called yesterday to be let known that this was going to be basically the last chance to come here before the estate sale and the house is going to be a place that we no longer come to as we have always when we came to Livermore. Well, I mean, we've been, yeah, I lived here for a while and obviously came here. But um, we were just gonna do a walk around Right. Yeah. Just kind of walk around, check out like room by room and just just inviting you guys along as well. But the main purpose of this video, I think for, for me at least, and posterity. for us. Posterity. Posterity, yeah. So we can yeah. have some video record and look back at uh, you know, maybe 20 years from now, just have, a, have something to look at. Not that there aren't videos that I did film here before, but like an intentional video that where we go through and, and check out all the different rooms and just kind of... Our last opportunity to reminisce. Last opportunity to reminisce physically in the place. Yeah. Although we could come back at a later point. <laughs> and maybe like, maybe hey, 20 years from now. <laughs> hey, well, my grandma used to live here. Do you mind if we do a little walkthrough? I did that at another building in town one time. Um, it didn't go so well. But... <laughs> <laughs> there's a... Uh, we'll start with the front yard, I guess. Look, we got... Uh, this wasn't always here. It wasn't always these... Uh, bushes and bricks, this little nice patio area. There was actually junipers that um, my dad over there and your dad yes. over over there somewhere took our uncle and would throw him into the junipers. The, my, da my dad and your dad would grab his hands or fling and feet the and they'd do a big old fling and toss him in the junipers. Those aren't there anymore. The bushes that I remember that aren't there anymore, two plants actually. And over here, we still have the scar Of the helicopter tree. Yeah, that's the other thing I was thinking about was the whirly birds. Yeah. There's no more whirly bird tree. Right over there. You yep. should drop them seeds that come down and... What, do we do that again? What do the seeds do? <laughs> right, like so. My autofocus is still not and working, if that wasn't obvious. The bushes that I, I think of next, as I'm sure you do. Oh, yeah. The Back jungle. there in the jungle. That was our jungle spot. It's, it's not looking like a jungle anymore. It's looking no. very wide open spaces. But these oleanders that are on this half were also on this half, and they were just... It was a jungle. It you was had to, a you jungle. had to climb in here. And aphids. As kids, <laughs> as small children, we had yeah. to climb in yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And remember, we would take, like, dirt claws, and we'd throw them at the wall so they'd leave little, <laughs> little like, spots on the wall. That was fun. I loved that. Oh, yes. All right, that's yes. enough for the yard. We got a lot. We got a lot more house to go through. I don't know why I repeat myself. Sometimes I do. I find myself doing that. We house got a lot to go more. through. House we got to go a lot through. more. We got a lot more house to go through. This has always been here. And this, I feel like this table's always been here too. Yeah, and at Christmas, that thing gets decorated with all the little village houses and a little. What's that? Not like a polyester snow blanket. Yeah. And uh, Christmas houses set up. I think they the, even lit up, yeah? Yeah. And then the living room, uh, where we... Well, this is the living room, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every Christmas, speaking of Christmas, well, I think Christmas is when we spent the most time here together. Yes. Um, as, as cousins, we probably... I mean, we came here for lots of other events, but I think Christmas was pretty solid, like for all, most of our childhood, every Christmas. We yeah, were, all the way up through, at least when I was in middle school, probably. Yeah, we would every Christmas we would gather in this living room right and here. For context, I'd live where he lives now, which is three hours away from here. Right. So I, I, I just lived, I lived five much. minutes away at that point. It was a little easier trip for us. Um, yeah, living room. Everybody would gather in a big circle. We'd Primarily, the tree would be 
here? Uh, the tree, the, or in here. later years, the tree was over there in that corner. Yeah. I know at least. I mean, it, I think there was, I think you're right, I think the tree Early was here on, for some, some points. This space. It was over here. And the awesome part, I mean, I remember coming down this hall, because I was the one that slept here, and I would come down this hall, and there were just presents. If the trees where that chair is, presents would come out to here, man. Every family would open their. Every family would open their presents. Because you guys were across town, little Dave was across town. So you guys would open, you know, those family presents. But then, everybody be here for the rest of the day. All the way to dinner. Yeah. And then, yeah, that was. Uh, that was good times. Definitely some good times. And gra Grandpa was always in charge. Grandpa was pretty, uh, oh. definitely, definitely militant. It was militant time, <laughs> which was good because we needed some order. <laughs> yeah. He was making sure, you know, once, once you open your present, you better toss him in the trash so he can put, get in the trash bag and we're not going to have a, a huge mess. And, and then the gift game would happen. Yeah. And we as kids would get exiled. Yes. Which I think is a good transition for us to go show where we were exiled to. Oh, yeah, down the hall. <laughs> it was actually nice, you know. We get the like the adults would kind of forget about us, and they would they would they would just make us, you know, go go spend our time, and we had to be quiet. And it started changing over the years. It's funny how it kind of changed over the years. This is probably the room that I spent the most time in. I'd say if so, there's focus peaking yeah. on here. If I'm blue, then I'm in focus. If I'm not blue, and this one's... then I'm not in focus. Um. The, yeah, it wasn't like this. This was Uncle Dave's old room, I think, for the most part. Our, our youngest uncle, he was, he was, you know, he was 15 when I was born, so he's like our kid uncle, always the fun one, telling, telling ghost stories and whatnot. But this room is where we would spend the most time, I think. This is where we were like, this was the kid room at that point. We would come down here, this little TV. We'd watch movies or whatever, like Christmas movies and stuff. In fact, I think I watched How the Grinch Stole Christmas in this room probably more than any other movie, no matter if it was June or July, it didn't matter. I would, I would watch How the Grinch Stole Christmas in this room. It was my biggest request. And uh, yeah, it was, uh, it was a good time. Yeah, we all come down here as cousins. Remember, I think Uncle Dave's big red bean bag was still down here. Black. black. Was it black? Okay. Black. I think I had floppy. It. Super floppy. And we picked that thing up and he would just Because <laughs> <laughs> there was nothing left of it. Right. Yeah. <laughs> that thing was awesome. You could hide under it. Yep. Yeah. No, cool, definitely. cool in the winter or cool in the summertime. And the Sega. Uh, yeah. Oh, I remember the uh, they, had, they had Pong, the Pong. Atari. I missed that. Yeah. Or I don't recall it, but <laughs> no, it was always Sonic for me. The other, uh, the other rooms, I don't really, I don't. Never did. They never. I mean, not that it didn't go there. I mean, this is, you know, we spent. We don't. I don't think we need to really reminisce about the bathroom. Maybe, do we, maybe we do. Yeah, yeah, Let's yeah, go. yeah, yeah. The bathroom. No, this is the bathroom, yeah. man. This is the bathroom. Post pool. Although, you know, post pool, I usually ended up in grandma's bathroom versus okay. this bathroom. Um, I mean, if there was somebody busy in there, just because it was closer. You know, you go from the, the slider right to the... Yes. Right to that bathroom for a little easier access, but... This thing's always been here. Oh, yeah. I, and there's like the... This was the medicine the cabinet. and the medicine cabinet, yeah. It was always kind of like a mystery, like... All the medicines in here, I'd look in there like, ooh, it's like grandma's little magic box of like healing. <laughs> and it Definitely. looks like it still is. <laughs> um, yeah, the bathroom. You know what the most memorable thing for me in here was when I came here today, first thing? How you have to reach all the way over there under the to toilet get the paper toilet paper. Roll <laughs> the way down there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, that, that wasn't very convenient at all. Still isn't. So this was, uh, I think this was Aunt Lynn's, Aunt Lynn's room. room. Yeah, and then this is where Grandma you know, spent uh, her resting times for the towards the end there. All the old family photos of people that not always people were sure who they were. We know that that's 
grandma, right? We know, oh, no, that's not you, grandma. You know more than I know if you're making that <laughs> Well, that's definitely grandpa right there, right? Uh, that one definitely is. <laughs> yeah, that one is obvious. <laughs> I don't need to do any guesswork on that one being grandpa. This one, I think we have a harder time like figuring out who all those people are. But somebody knows. Oh, that doesn't have a dot on it, though. It doesn't have a dot on it. So there's like I'll there's dots back. on stuff for what people are claiming. So we're basically trying to move stuff out and have it not go to the estate. This so. is this is an essential. Oh, there we go. That's a classic. There we go. For That's sure. the aunts and the uncles. That's my dad. My dad. Uncle Dave. And Aunt Lynn. Aunt Lynn. Yep. Yeah. Pretty cool. It's kind of cool. It's it's nice the way the Lord um, kind of put my personal family together because I, I kind of know that dynamic already. You know, it's like the order, the ages, and the yeah. gaps, and the genders, and the, it's like, okay, I, I've seen how that can work. And so I kind of know what to expect. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 because you have that exact layout. You have that exact layout, same yeah. with like age gaps and everything. Um, this was the computer room. Yes. This was a cool room. It was like, we actually, we were actually allowed in this room a we lot just, more than I think would be reasonable. Or that I utilized. <laughs> we were we were allowed in here. We weren't always. I think that's the thing. We weren't always allowed in here. No. It was like you can't. I don't think we were often allowed in here unsupervised. Yeah. I did do a cool interview video with Grandma in here at one point where we sat down and like, I just kind of asked her like her thoughts on the internet and stuff and like where the world was at, you know, modern, sort of modern day at the time compared to. The, the stuff that she remembered her, and her values and stuff and she has some pretty cool stories to tell about grandpa rushing her out of a restaurant before she went over to uh, talk to a couple about how they should be talking to each other instead of staying on their phones the entire meal <laughs> <laughs> grandpa was like you better not Lucille and she's like oh I think I'm gonna and he just like got her up and walked her around the other way of the restaurant so she couldn't say anything <laughs> What she got there? Copper? Uh, Parliament Buildings in Barbados. Oh, interesting. Mm, very. Wood carving bench. I always love that you could see the pool from that. Ooh, I just had a flashback to one of my earliest memories of being in this room was before there was even a pool outside, and Uncle Dave was um, at that window right there, and there was a cherry tree where the pool is now, and he was um, picking off birds with a BB gun that were eating the cherries. And that was like his, his little job. And it's pretty cool. I remember being pretty impressed as a Holy safe, person. Batman. Oh, you've never seen that safe before? No. That's no joke. Yeah, I went, I went under the house at one point and re reinforced the floor so that safe could be there. Grandpa would walk by it and it would like rock. So I went down and put some extra, um, what do you call it? Yeah. Some stability, some stabilizing beams well, to that's... keep it from. Rocking too hard. That's no it's joke. Dark in this room. Yeah, that's a serious safe. Yeah. They're probably gonna leave it there. I <laughs> mean, it's bolted to the floor. You know? Is it? Probably. Yeah, that's why it was rocking so much. When... It's for sale. Oh, it's for sale. Never mind. It's for sale. It's all you, Kazo. I mean. <laughs> I can... Oh, let's let's go to. We won't. We'll kind of skip the the bedroom. I mean, it's Grandma Grandpa's bedroom. Yeah. We don't, we don't need to go in there. I don't think for a video. Yeah. And it's also not her bedroom anymore. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll skip the bedroom. And we we spent limited time down there anyway. Right. This corner, where was it? This corner. This is the corner that my second child went headlong into when he was up here with my father, and getting stitches. And I didn't find out till they were at the hospital. I think I missed the call and got a voicemail saying that my son was in the hospital. Right there. You know what I was always amazed, speaking of like people running their heads into things and like having to go to the hospital, I was always kind of amazed that nobody really <laughs> took a forehead to those bricks right there. Well, I always I feel like somebody could have or should have just based on like the height and the, the how many times we had run in circles around that whole living room to kitchen area and just like do circles and like sprinting and running and chasing and running back and forth and, and see because the thing is he's running through that side but you can just come right through the other side and <laughs> that, so that would go on for for ages and you never knew which direction somebody else was going to be going to try and cut you off you know so like so you think he's going to come over there and he is this time but sometimes somebody might turn the other way okay. and come back out the other direction 
<laughs> and nobody ever like bit it and like hurt injured themselves on that those bricks sticking out, which is incredible, I think. Um, before we go outside, let's just take a quick peek into the. Well, this is where we always had family, you know, like Thanksgiving dinner, um, Christmas dinner. Yeah, and here the tables and then extend it out. And it's, here, yeah. right, two tables, and yeah. The candle, the candles, whoever got to blow out the candle before anybody leaves the table, that was, that was always a fun thing. And just, uh, just the gather, just, just, it was nice. Oh, but then there was the kids' table. The kids' table was over here in the other kitchen. We often got... Eventually. Home. Yeah, eventually, well... Or, it uh, depends, I think, maybe it was a Thanksgiving thing, but Christmas, there's a kids' table here. Oh, right, I right, think right. maybe Thanksgiving, they kicked us into the other room. Mm, yeah, and then at some point, the, the or, kid, the, the level of, like, how young you could be to come sitting here changing out. I remember thinking it was unfair because I was at the kids' table for, you know, pretty much my entire kid career because I had to be with the kids. But then eventually, like, when I started coming here, people started coming in at younger and younger ages. And I was like, when I was your age, I was still at the kids' table. Anyway, definitely lots of cool. Back in my day, <laughs> her, 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 had to sit at the kids' table. <laughs> so, this <laughs> was... The table, the kitchen table. We had lots of good conversations. I feel like this is where you you heard most of Grandma's opinions were at this table right here. Yeah? Is that fair to say? Yeah. Crosswords got done every day. You wake up in the morning and come out here, Grandma and Grandma sitting right over there drinking her coffee with the paper. Yeah. And this table has had more dice rolls on it than a casino table in Vegas. <laughs> That's <laughs> true. That's true. That's <laughs> true. Oh, that's good times. Oh, man. Okay. I think we should enter the pool from, from the, the uh, from front. The, from the front what? From the front of the house? Yeah. Enter the pool there from was, the front of the house. There was right. one. Oh, there's something out there that we did. Well, just the missed? one time that we did that. What time? Wait, wait. The one time that we did I, what? Let me double check and make sure that the gates functional. Okay. He's going to make sure that we can actually get in that way. And there's the garage. We don't really need to, I don't think we need to like check out the garage. We didn't really spend any time with it. Oh, there, there's a drink fridge. There's the drink fridge in the garage. I think we should probably, maybe we can see from right here. Hello. <laughs> garage. Uh, over there, there's a brown refrigerator. You can kind of see it right there in the very center top. There's a brown refrigerator. That's the drink fridge. You come out into the garage and there's drinks in there. Always. There was never not. There's never a time when there wasn't a drink in that brown fridge. So, drink fridge, yeah. <laughs> That's a cool way to show it. Also, there's a line here. You yeah. do not cross that line with your tires. <laughs> I you see people do it, though. Do not park on the pebble. No. <laughs> There used to be like plum trees out here. Yes. And these rocks. These rocks are cool. Those are cool rocks, wouldn't you say? I, I would. I would say those um, are cool rocks. What's up? So, I'm a little fuzzy on the details. I just recall, was it me? Was it, who, who jumped the gate? We were with Uncle Dave, and this was definitely an Uncle Dave shenanigan. And we were all hanging out, and we decided we must have been staying at your folks' house. You know what I'm talking about? Um, I mean, I we, remember times when Uncle Dave was staying at folks' house and... We were all there. We came and jumped the fence while Grandma and Grandpa were here. Were you uh, there for that? I don't know, maybe. It's possible I could have been on yeah. sub 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 I don't know, what were you really talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, Uncle Dave brings us over here. This gate is always locked, period. So. We went over, and then, and then in while Grandma and Grandpa are sleeping in their room. I just want to, I just want to. Oh yeah, the garage. Yeah, just for, I, I wasn't gonna go in the garage. I kind of peeked through the mail slot, but I just wanted. And here to, we are. It, this is the most important part about the garage right here, for sure. There you go. See, drinks always. Cheers. I actually came in here and drank beers when I wasn't allowed to at one point. 
That was fun. <laughs> uh, I was close to all. I was old enough for Europeans, uh, I think. European status. All right, so moving towards the end. We're in the backyard. You know what? I, I ever, only ever had two lucid dreams, like dreams where I knew while I was dreaming that I was dreaming for a fact. And in both of those dreams, I was here at Grandma's house. Only two dreams I ever had where I like just knew. I was dreaming, and I was like, I'm in I am dreaming right now. What am I gonna do? And I won't take up all the time sharing the first one. The second one is more simple. I just came, and I, it was here in the backyard, and I was like, I'm dreaming. And what am I gonna do? Where's that? And there was nobody around. There was nobody. So I like went over there and like climbed up the uh, onto the roof, jumped up on the roof, and I was looking over the fence, like checking out the school, and like, being, but there was nobody anywhere, and I was like. Where's everybody? I'm dreaming. We should do something cool. Let's like do something. But then there, there's nobody. I was like, come on. Like, I don't know how long I'm gonna be dreaming for. Somebody show up and let's do something. And then, then I woke up. I was like, gosh, dang it. Anyway, pool. Many a whirlpool made. Many a whirlpool, many a performance given. You remember standing at this end over here? I think it was mostly your sisters dictating this. Probably Cheryl. Give me a why. And we'd somebody jump in. We gotta find those movies. I'm sure they're somewhere. <laughs> right. We would all line up on this end and spell some word, and like each kid would say the letter and then jump. Yeah. Oh. Diving for plastic goldfish. It's good stuff. And there used to be a hot tub over there too. Just running back yes, and forth between was. the hot tub and the, the thing. And this thing, I, I'm surprised that this structure is still standing, yeah. to be honest. Like, it's incredible that this is still here. It's been here. This was here before the pool. No, it wasn't? No, it wasn't? I'm tripping. <laughs> there were trees then that mimicked the shade. <laughs> I'm glad that somebody was here to correct me on that. But it looks cool. It's, it looks great for video. Look at how great this looks for video, Kazo. It's fantastic. It looks so good. I want to. I want to shoot. Too bad. That, too bad we're not gonna be here anymore because this is a great spot to film. Oh, look at those lines. All these leading lines. It's beautiful. I'm nerding out. Charlie. Oh, thank you. I couldn't. I couldn't believe we were gonna almost forget Charlie. Can't forget Charlie. Dude. This is Charlie. He's probably the least recognized member of the family. <laughs> he is definitely the longest pet that we've had <laughs> in the family. And he would spray the windows. Oh yeah, that was, we'd always we'd sit in there and wait for yeah, him wait to for spray. him to come <laughs> right like up a, the wall, and then his little tail would come like right a out. Like a work of breaching. Yeah. That was cool. Bye, Charlie. Good times. Great oldies. See you, Charlie. All right, Cuzzo. Well, Michael and I are going to get to work and start helping loading up some stuff and get myself in focus here, hopefully. Oh, you know what? Oh, I got good news. That lens that I sent out, they're not charging me to fix it. Ooh. Yeah, really hopefully good they news. don't watch your video of dropping it. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah. Well, they said they're not. Apparently, it's all within what? Anything within 90 days of them repairing it, they'll Anything. just repair it. I don't know that. Apparently. Hey, don't argue. I'm not trying to. And don't send them the link. <laughs> <laughs> All right, folks. Well, thanks for uh, joining us for our little tour of uh, Grandma and Grandpa's house and our little reminiscent uh, memory lane trip. Uh, I think it was. I think it was pretty good. Do you feel like we? Do you feel like we covered some good bases there? And yeah, you got me to break, which is good. I didn't do nothing. You broke yeah. on your own, buddy. I wouldn't have done that if you weren't here. It's all right. It's good. Cathartic. Yeah, it's good. Got to got to have those moments. Okay. Now let them happen. Well, you all take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and uh, thanks for joining us for Grandma Grandpa's house tour. Uh, see you on the next video. Aloha. <laughs>